Because people spend up to 90% of their time indoors, it's important to know that our homes, schools, and places of business have safe indoor air quality. Some indoor pollutants can cause allergies, infections, trigger asthma attacks, and even lead to cancer. According to the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, health effects from indoor air pollutants may be experienced soon after exposure or possibly years later. These indoor air quality pollutants may include a variety of different contaminants and gases, mold, carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide, volatile organic compounds, formaldehyde, and radon are some of the most frequent culprits. Knowing the facts about indoor air quality is essential to maintaining one's health. To help people test their indoor air quality, IEQ Index has introduced easy-to-use test kits that are based on years of scientifically accepted research. The kits have been designed for use by homeowners, health professionals, property managers, and anyone in need of testing their air. Simply follow the basic instructions and send your samples off to be analyzed. Within a short period of time, you will receive your results. What makes IEQ Index so unique is the fact that the results are health-based and easy to understand. A unique air quality index is assigned to each kit after laboratory analysis. A numerical index is calculated based on the results from all of the individual parameters analyzed. Descriptive, color-coded ratings are assigned that summarizes the findings. IEQ Index offers a number of different test kits based on your needs. If you have concerns over volatile organic compounds, radon, other gases, or mold, there is a kit just for that. If you want a more comprehensive look at your indoor air quality, IEQ Index offers a bundled kit that offers significant savings. IEQ Index kits are easy to use, and the laboratory results come from some of the nation's leading accredited scientific laboratories. Order your kit today to ensure your indoor air quality is healthy for you and your family.